Hi everyone, I'm Margarita Muradova, a personal stylist and fashion consultant from Kiv Ukraine. And in today's video, we're going to talk about top trends for the summer 2023. So some clothing items, some accessories, some materials that are going to be very in this specific moment. Those things I feel like this specific summer is are very like vast. So definitely each and every person is going to have something to pick from, I'm pretty sure. And I'm really happy about the fact that there's so many things that are popular at the moment and are trendy in the moment. There's so many of them that are kind of on the basic side so you don't necessarily need to go all out on the colors and textures in order to be on trend if you're willing to go that way so the first thing we're going to talk about specifically is lace lace everything lace bras lace skirts lace dresses lace blouses lace cardigans lace swimwear lace accessories all of these things and more and one of the brands that i felt particularly feel i'm very good at this is definitely for example a ukrainian brand called olenich and their two-piece set with a lace kind of cardigan and a skirt and those are on the sheer side but you definitely always can wear them and pair them with something that's like shorts and like a bra top or a bralette or maybe like a uh, tank top if you're not feeling too like revealing but also there's acne studios which i feel like inspired all of these lace things for sure and lace can be basic and lace can be neutral and lace can be not that provocative and depends on what you pair it with and if you're feeling very unsure about like pairing lace with something you can always go for example for a lace pant or a la lace maxi skirt layered with something that's like longer up top so like a shirt an oversized men's style cotton and poplin shirt let's say linen shirt but also maybe like layering it over a swimwear with an unbuttoned shirt over it and it's going to be beautiful there's going to be a lot of textures and what i love about lace is the fact that it's very feminine but also can bring a lot of texture to a look and make it look more complete so i feel like lace is everyone's cup of tea but you also always need to make sure to do it your own way and i feel like with lace you can do that for sure and the next thing is going to be very trendy this summer and actually for the last couple of summers in a row is like an extraction from tie-dye called dip dye it's basically like a watered out watercolor print i'd say and it looks very feminine and beautiful and it's been here for ages for sure but in this way i feel like it's very appropriate for the summer because it's so breezy it's inspired kind of by nature and all the colors that we get from there and it looks absolutely beautiful specifically on something that's like a total look so maybe like an ensemble of a top and trousers or also maybe like a longer maxi dress because there's a lot of like length and space to it so there's some space for this print to kind of work its magic as opposed to like a crop top if you know what i mean the next trend that's definitely in at the moment specifically for the summer which is really interesting is sequins and those sequins are actually very like marine inspired by all of this like mermaid core aesthetic and it's so beautiful when you do it right so for example there is an amazing brand called self-portrait and you know them for sure by their dresses and their lace dresses they were very popular like seven to eight years back but now they have this beautiful set of a cardigan top and a skirt or a pant i'm not sure covered with bluish turquoise-ish semi-sheer sequins and it looks so beautiful so marine inspired so mermaid core but to an extent that you can wear it and look presentable and i love the set because it's so beautiful to pair it with something else so for example you can wear the top separately and the pants separately as well with something that's not sheer in order to kind of create this contrast of different textures and i feel like sequins can definitely be very daytime appropriate if you wear them with something casual like a let's say tank top a um, t-shirt a crop top and some heels for the night and they can 
kind of brighten up a lock and uh, they move they create this movement in a lock that give more texture to a lock so i feel like they're an amazing option to have for the summer specifically the next thing that's very popular this summer and they're very practical also are uh, not caps so basically this is like a mix between a baseball cap and then a uh, kind of scarf tied in a knot over your head. This is a mix of a scarf and a baseball cap. And it looks so elegant, especially if it's done in this like satiny kind of a material, but also it could be done in a cotton material and linen. And those are beautifully done, for example, by an amazing Ukrainian brand called uh, Ruslan Baginski. And they also are done, I'm pretty sure, by Gunya, which is also a beautiful accessories and homeware brand, Ukrainian brand. And those were actually initially done the past couple of seasons by Totem and The Row. And I feel like they look absolutely sleek and beautiful and feminine and minimalistic but also useful in a way and they give something like uh, to a look which i feel like sometimes very lacking in terms of like head accessories and head pieces they're either too sporty or too textured and there's not enough like minimalistic sleek options for everyone that are actually working for the summer so they're actually covering your head and they're also protecting you from the sun so i feel like this one is a beautiful mix of these two and the next thing that's going to be very popular is straw bags this is a no-brainer, I feel like. I feel like each and every summer, everyone's going for straw bags. They give texture to a look. And if you know me, you know I'm big on texture. I feel like textures can get this beautiful finished touch even to a an otherwise minimalistic, neutral, basic look because texture is something that's going to create more depth to a look. So it's not very like flat it's very 3d and uneven which i love i feel like also straw is very beautiful and it's very durable in terms of wearing it to the beach an actual beach bag but it's also very good to travel with if you're traveling for like a holiday destination because it fits like a lot of stuff just like a usual shopper would but it also doubles up as a beach bag when you get to the destination so i feel like it's a win-win in this situation and also it pairs beautifully with summery flowy dresses with jean shorts and with linen tops so with everything that's summery and flowy and beautiful with everything that we'll actually appreciate and love summer for straw bags are actually the hit to work this into your summer wardrobe and actually there's so many straw bag options in mass market middle market and obviously luxury segment but honestly i don't feel like you need to splurge on a straw bag because they're pricey in a luxury market they go up to like one thousand two thousand dollars and you're only kind of wearing it during the summer most of the time not like during the winter unlike provisions because they sometimes get inspired by this whole Jane Birkin aesthetic and wear their straw bags with like fur coats etc most people in the rest of the world usually wear straw bags only during the summer so it makes them less like mixable and workable for your wardrobe so i don't necessarily feel like you need to spend this much money on something that's going to sit in your closet nine months out of 12. so you might as well go for the must market or your local brands or actually which is really cool you can go to your destination your holiday destination and there's a lot of local markets in there and most of the time they have their straw bags for like $15, $10, $20. Very inexpensive, very beautiful, very durable, very summery, and definitely a go to summer piece for sure. And the last piece we're going to talk about that's very trendy this specific summer is something that's very, like, kind of Middle East inspired, and I love it about this. It's kaftans. They're so elegant. They're so beautiful and also they're modest in case you're looking for like a modest version of a summer dress, but something that's also workable for the night out and for in the meantime because kaftans, they're very grand. They're very like bourgeois to me. I feel like they're very 
beautiful in this like magnificent sense so that you can wear them as a cover-up for the beach you can wear them with sandals and like even like Birkenstocks during the day when you're walking around the city but you can also pair them with like high heels or kitten heels and a satiny the row ascot type back for the night and you're gonna look so beautiful so elegant so feminine and not very revealing so if that's what you're looking for this is definitely the option to go for for the summer and obviously let me know in the comments below which one of these trendy pieces is something that you're gonna experiment with this specific summer and uh, yeah this is it for this video and i'll see you in the next one bye